My name is Thadnos. You can just call me Thad, though. And I've been working here since... Not that long, actually. I've been working here since June. I've been in comic books for years. I would have to say since I was a kid, but, like, I really, like, got into comic books when I was in middle school, so, like, 10, 12. For a long time, it was uncool to be viewed as a geek. So would you say that there's a sense of bitterness now that this is so cool? There was some bitterness, because I also like anime a lot, too. And, you know, like, the anime kid was always the very kid, you know? So like, yeah, there was some bitterness, but like seeing the uptick, it's just like more people enjoying great stories. And I feel like it's just making it feel more legitimate, which I have no problem with, you know? And the more money going into the comic book industry, there's more money coming out, which means more books are being made. So all in all, I feel like it's just a good thing. Yeah. I feel like the thing about comic books is just like, it's was an up, untapped media kind of, cause like, we got spy movies, the spy movie craze. We got like the Chinese kung fu flicks, that was the craze. And now the new thing is the superhero movie. Everyone wants that new action packed thing to kind of watch, kind of enjoy. And right now, that is superheroes. So I feel like we're just going through that trend right now. Uh, it's a lot of locals that come here. I feel like there's like a really, a real community here. I can't speak for all comic book shops, I can only speak for this one. But like, even like upstairs, you saw everyone was hanging out, everyone was talking. Everyone's friends. There's not much like bad energy. It's just like people come in and they feel like this is their safe space. Like this is their safe haven. People can come in and they can talk about what they like to talk about. And I feel like that's really important to have. This shop doesn't sell comic books, mm -hmm. right? Because a lot of people, when you start selling comic books, you get into like a tricky kind of situation. You gotta like, you gotta appraise the comic books. And you also gotta be able to resell the comic books. And like right now we're not at like a status where like, we're big enough to really be able to buy and sell comic books and still make a profit. So it's like, well, instead of that, let's offer a service to the community where we can give the people the opportunity to sell comic books that they want to sell. But instead of us buying it, it is other people in the community. So you can just swap the books and you can sell it directly to the person without having that middleman. So it kind of provides a solution to a problem. I actually love indie books. Those are the books I kind of read the most. I feel like it's the guy started with Invincible before Invincible was like super popular. I was reading Invincible like when I was like 12, which honestly shouldn't have been, but that's just that's the point. I feel like more people read the indie books. Of course, you're always gonna have the people that have like DC, the Marvel, but I feel like it's kind of getting to the point where Image is also getting up there with like the upper echelon of comic books as well. Like, I feel like it's also starting to become a household name and they're very much the indie starters. I feel like, DC and Marvel, in terms of mainstream, yeah, they're bigger, but I feel like if you go into like the comic book community, you're going to get a lot of more people that are like, oh, big into Image and Dark Horse especially. I feel like Valiant has kind of just dropped off a little bit though. I, I can't even speak for them much. But I will say Image, I feel like within the comic book community is really just as big as one of those figureheads. Like you'll get someone just as excited for Image coming. Like Saga's coming back. And everyone is freaking out about Saga, and it's an image book, so I feel like image is up there as well. I don't think comic books are dying, actually. I feel like there's more interest than ever, actually, in comic books. I feel like comic books themselves are not dying out, because you can look at um, like services like Webtoon. They're super huge. I feel like the medium as we know it now, or like in the past, is kind of starting to die out, kind of like that... You go into the shop, you get the books, that kind of experience is going to start to fall off a little bit. But I feel like kind of that online service is going to keep like rising and becoming more pop, more and more popular. So I feel like comic books will never die out. It's kind of like you will never say books are going to die out. You'll always read books. And I feel like it's kind of the same thing.